And let's do our usual, like, search everything, now yeah. that we have him. I get the feeling I might be seeing a lot of Paul tonight. Go down behind Brandon House again. Mm. Let's try that. You think we can so actually can do anything besides stare at the garage now? <laughs> oh. uh, nope. Random. You oh, son of a... <laughs> Rando. All right, okay, yeah. Let's, let's start. Let's go back everywhere. and start here. All right. Let's go back up the street. And do we want to call the chief yet or no? No, because we don't. We don't have. I don't think the chief is useful until you've gotten everything that you need from that time. Right. And then you can be like, "Hey, I got all this stuff. What do you think, chief?" And he'll be like, "Hmm, maybe think about this." Uh, we were just there. I want to go over to the farm and then up that path. Okay. See if there's anything new. Just back in case. There. Yeah, yeah. Good idea. Because he's not going to have any new information for us, but maybe there's new stuff here. Yeah, maybe maybe he's done some weird stuff in the greenhouses. Maybe, I don't know. Go into the greenhouse. Uh, uh, I, I keep hoping that that drunk's just going to appear. Like, he's rah. just going to be in here like, rah. hey. Okay, so let's go to the pub. Okay. Mm, um, investigate behind the yeah, pub? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, and we gotta look in the in the restaurant too. That's true. Hello. Hello. Nothing. Anybody? Man. Man, I want that. We need a flashlight so badly. I know. That one area. There was something there. I knows it. I believe it. Go in the pub. Go in the pub. Okay. Okay. Jeez. Go in the pub. Jeez. We gotta look in the restaurant. Detective hard ass. Jeez. Jeez. Nothing. Okay. Okay, fine. Okay, so we'll go here, and then we can go over here. Mm-hmm. Nothing. Nothing. Poop. All right. Uh, uh, that's those two. Yeah. Let's continue into the woods. Um, go along the path to the right, right? Because that's the dead end. Yeah. yeah. Nothing. Okay. All right. Uh, into the woods into to find the, the clue. Go to Go the jetty. To the jetty. Nothing. Nope. They're still over there. They're still there. We're on a camping trip. Damn it, that's no. the definite wrong way. Go back to the junction. Go right to Wood Lane. The junction? Is that where I want to go? The junction, I think, yeah. And then further into the woods. Yeah. Yeah. Into the, the clearing. clearing. Yeah. Nothing. Aw, oh, man. That's fine, because I feel like we had to go to the Atlas, like, uh... Yeah, we gotta look in their kitchen. Go down the corridor. So the kitchen must be down the corridor there, if what Paul said is true. Yep. Ooh, go to the Mag TV. Magnifying glass. Womp. Oh. Did you just... Ooh, mugs. Ooh, ooh. mugs. Ooh, oh, so yeah. many. Ooh. Straws. Interesting. <laughs> well, there's a TV right there with a DVD player. That is very convenient. <laughs> yeah, that is quite that is suspicious. Very convenient. Yeah, okay. Triple X, huh? Go over to the TV. Uh, try DVD from the pile. Oh my god, I want to do that. What it? What are these? Yes, Atlas. <laughs> Boo! <laughs> Freedom. True freedom means freedom from many vices that society had traditionally believed to be virtues. Self-criticism, self-doubt, guilt. Ladies and gentlemen, these are not virtues. These are sins. Born of a fake morality implanted deep within our minds and collective consciousness by governments and religions through the ages with the sole purpose of preventing the masses, stopping us 
from achieving the same success, happiness and freedom enjoyed by those at the very pinnacle of society. I'm going to show you that common morality is nothing more than the cynical creation of an elite desperate to stay in power. An elite hell-bent on preventing you from reaching your full potential by making you feel guilty for pursuing success. But the good news is that you can take back control. You can become the success you deserve to be. Atlas will give you a unique and powerful advantage. The music is Life getting really creepy. Life technicolor glory can be yours. All that you have to do is to stay, embrace it, enjoy it, and learn to love your ambition. Welcome to Atlas. Yep. Okay. Yep. All right. Yep. Mm -hmm. What if, what if, wait, but what if we try another DVD from the file? Will it be the same one? <laughs> it's just he keeps a stack of his, of his same. <laughs> of the same DVD. I love myself. Let no one question how much. Yeah. Ah, it's, uh, it's the same. Okay. Let no one question how much I love myself. I have 15 DVDs. I love myself and my ambition. And my suspicious. Click to try using this. Yeah. Yeah. Go on. I mean, there's three X's, so porn. What? Uh What? Wait, what? Somebody just a video of somebody just stealing wallets? Here's the thing. Well, that was odd. Looked like someone pickpocketing, but why make a video of it? You're asking the wrong question, Jenksy. Why label it triple X? Of all the videos that you could have hid that under, Triple X is the one people are going to want to watch. Yeah, no joke. If anything, I'd, I'd label it like Joanna Man or White Girls. What? No, one, no one's going to want to watch those movies. That's what I'm saying. No one want to watch those, and right. so no one will ever know that's where you hid it under. Hmm. Right? But I think this is leading to us finally asking some questions about Kate's license. <gasps> and having them be like, yeah, okay, I pickpocketed a thing and it turned out to be her wallet and I dumped her license in the woods. Like, oh, you're right. You're absolutely right. That's finally going to be a thing. It all comes down to that bike and the homebrew. It's all going to come make sense full circle. <laughs> the bike was the key the whole time. <laughs> uh, let's try this door now. Yeah, go in there. Let yourself go. Uh. Feel your soul. And wait for the moment to break free. Then break free. <laughs> Excellent, Hannah. Well, <laughs> will you come back later, please? What's going on here? <laughs> please leave. Sorry, Ryan, there's a few more questions I have to ask you yet, and uh, time's ticking by. gave in so easily. Yeah. I would have sat down and been like, what are we doing? <laughs> I've got my own mask. I brought, I, I found <laughs> yeah, he it. he puts the mask on. <laughs> I brought my own. Oh, we'd be such better detectives. I brought my own mask. <laughs> That'd be great. Let's try the lounge door just for lulz. <laughs> just walk in. Yeah, there's no one there. Okay, here's the thing though. We go back. Down, all the way back down here, uh -huh. and then talk to everyone again, because I imagine they're going to have a lot to say. Uh-oh. What? What is that? The car. He's, his dad's car. <gasps> Are we going to get to search the car? 
Whoop, 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 whoop. Okay, let's do that really quick. Where was that at? Here? Yes. Oh, we're gonna go search the car. Go behind whoop, Brandon whoop. house. Search that car grill. Come on, the remote control lock. Yes. Yeah. Oh, or, oh, or that. Oh, it opens. That. Yeah, there we go. Huh? Yeah, totally. Knew that would happen. <laughs> Same outcome. <gasps> the bike! Bikes! Oh my god, it's all coming together. So, those are Ryan's guitars. Kept in a garage. Not really the best place to keep them. Wait, 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 Ryan's get. Why would we? Why, why would we, we, we didn't know that? Oh my God! Why would we care? <laughs> I hope this turns into an '80s style ending where we're like, Ryan, your dad made you think that you couldn't be the best guitar player in the world, but you can. And Ryan's like, Yeah, I love myself the and last my ambition. Five minutes is Jenks headlining a new band, <laughs> where Ryan's playing the guitar and and Emma is in the background like on drums. Yes, and all, like, and it's like. We're the detectives and we're coming to you. <laughs> Solving crimes, that's what we do. And it's really cheesy. Perfect. I love it. Best ending. Okay. Uh, I want to go to the farm and I want to talk to him. Because <clears throat> I imagine he's going to have stuff to say about creepy cult Just a few more questions stuff. if you don't mind. Yeah, and... and well, what do you think about guitars? What do you think about XXX DVDs? Seen this before. No, what is it? Do you recognize it? No. Should I? Let I me mean, play it for you, question mark? Like, yeah. that's really do, do, the question. Do you recognize this one disc? What do you know about doll burning? Doll burning? What sort of doll burning? It doesn't mean anything to you. <laughs> Should it? No, that's okay. Uh. Okay. Maybe we should have been uh, ex explain explained a little a bit. A little, better. yeah. We should explain a little bit more. Really, he knows nothing about any of this, huh? Mm, interesting. Okay. Well, bye then. I guess? Question mark. Yeah, that's so weird. Okay. That's all for the moment. Thank you. I thought if if anyone would know, he would know stuff. Well, let's go talk to his dad. Be like, hi, hi, well, scary dad. Well, let's talk dad. to Rebecca first. Okay. Because here's my question. Every time drugs is brought up, they're like, go see Rebecca. That's true. And Rebecca's like, I don't poison myself. Everyone's like, no, she had the hookup, though. <laughs> she knows. Everyone in this town's like, she had the hookup. No, but then, but we definitely also got to talk to Simon, because we're going to be like, Simon, you go to these classes and you burn these dolls? Like, what's up? Yeah, what is the matter with you? Give us some deets. Bing. Ask about a few more things, please. Ah, uh, yes, this. The suspicious DVD. Do you know anything about this? No, sorry. Ask Ryan. I want to, trust me. Yeah, he's busy burning dolls. Speaking of which... What do you know about doll burning at Atlas? Only that it's part of the course. I'm not entirely sure what they're for, but I made dozens for him. You made them? Oh, Ryan can't make anything. He's practically dyspraxic. What does that mean? Whatever it means, it is insulting. <laughs> Super insulting. I love those two and their marriage. Me too. <laughs> I married him because he's filthy rich. What a mess. He's like, eh, I'm cheating on her. I don't even care. <laughs> like, we both got our shit. Does Whatever. Ryan play the guitar? <laughs> he tries. He does keep wasting money on them, though. I think he believes if he buys the right one, he'll suddenly turn into Jimi Hendrix. Sad, really. I just let him play in his room. As long as he plays in there, I don't mind. Okay, well. Uh, okay. I don't think any of that told us anything, but. Yeah. Be back later on, if that's okay. We did. She makes the dolls. Yeah, so we she know makes that. dolls. Creepy doll lady. Simon. Simon. Oh, he's gonna have some good stuff. I want Simon to, to be like. To oh! Couple of questions, if that's is that okay? Backdoor Sluts 9 when he sees the. <laughs> Suspicious DVD? Oh, man, that was my favorite. I know this DVD. I watched this so many have times. Have you seen this? Before. No. No, sorry. Like, anyone's gonna fess up to, like, have you seen this triple X yeah. DVD before? The second you see it, like, oh uh, no. <laughs> I definitely didn't what make did that. What do you know about doll burning? 
not on the course. It's a ritual thing. It's uh, getting rid of things that you don't need. Throw it into the fire. And that's a good thing? Well, yeah, it helps you getting rid of things you don't need. You it's throw it in the fire. <laughs> again. So what are the masks for? They're just to help you get into the right frame of mind. Uh, just get you into the zone, you know, help with the trance. A trance? Yeah, yeah. It's like, um, it's like self-hypnosis. We do it on the course sometimes. It's just to help you get into the right frame of mind, you know. So you hypnotise yourself. How do you do that? Just stare into a mirror and chant something. A you know, uh, just scrying mirror? Over and over again. Or you could just close your eyes and put yourself into a trance. Some people can do that. And that's safe? Well, yeah. Hypnosis doesn't work the way that most people think it does. You can't just be hypnotised if you don't want to be hypnotised. But you can learn to hypnotise yourself. What did you say it was called? Auto hypnosis. By the way, look in the background. Self hypnosis. Oh, there's a puppy back there. What is? Yeah. There's one behind him Simon too. Was a bit is that too she said? quick to play down the role of auto hypnosis on the course. I'll have to uh, ask around about this. Yes, we definitely will. New thing. New so thing to what ask did about. we? Doll burning. Okay. Help you get in a trance. Question. Mm-hmm. Uh, let's go back up to mask. Uh, seminars. Okay, that doesn't help us. He did. Yeah. He's totally truthful there. Okay. What about his guitar collection? <laughs> what do you know about Ryan's guitar collection? Uh, not a whole lot. I know he brought a guitar to one of the groups once at the end of one of the stages. That's the only time I've seen him with a guitar. I would have loved it if he was like, what do I know about his guitar? What does he know about my bike? <laughs> if he cared, he would ask. <laughs> and then there's that. Okay, Emma. Thank you. Probably Emma, what do you later. know about auto-hypnosis? Ooh, I like that. Let's start there. Do you know what auto-hypnosis is? Um, it's some type of self-hypnosis, isn't it? Yeah. Have you ever tried it? No, I haven't. But I think Kate was into it. She learned it from when she went to Atlas. And what did she tell you about it? Um, not a, not a lot, really. I think it helped her. I think she used it as a sort of self-meditation. Okay. okay, what do you know about Ryan's guitar? This is very important now. What do you know about Ryan's guitar collection? I mean, you collection? were boning him. I know he plays, because he tried to buy one off me. Do you play? I used to. I used to be in a band, uh, but I was a oh. singer as well, so I got away with it. Singer as well? Yeah, I used to sing in a band every night. But uh, sometimes it was in a pub, but usually at Rebecca's. What was that called? It was called Black Zone. Oh! And uh, this. Oh my guy God! From the Why are you coming together? Why do you have to hit me? I'm sorry. The band was rubbish, but that I was good. <laughs> so after that, I don't think they liked me much, and then we broke up after college. Can't hide talent. Interesting. Oh, she was in. Black she was Zone. offered a singing contract. Wait. Interesting. So she was. Wasn't. Rebecca talked about Blackstone. Right. But, again, we can't use, like, all the things that she said we can't use against Emma. I know, but I thought... Hold on. Can I see this for just a second? Yeah. Yeah. I thought... I thought... I thought Liam was in Blackstone. No? no. What did no. Rebecca say about Blackstone? Rebecca that said that they used to play there, play there, and yeah, yeah, yeah. And that was it. I don't remember. We have to go back to her anyway. Mm -hmm. What do you know about doll burning? Doll burning. I think it was something that they did on the course. Simon mentioned it. Mm -hmm. Oh, they didn't do that when you were there. No. Okay. Thank God, because it was weird. Yeah, day one. <laughs> like, now we're going to burn these dolls and put masks. Here's the crazy thing about that. <laughs> That kind of stuff happened my first year of theater uh -huh. in college all the time. <laughs> We're going to put these masks on so you can hide your, like, so none of you will judge the others. And then you'll stand and you and can be free to be our Stare selves. into the invisible fire of life. Was, oh, yeah. That was the first year of theater without a doubt. I'm glad we both did enough theater to know <laughs> that those things actually happen. <laughs> now we will spend 45 minutes as trees. 
Mm -hmm. Choose an animal. Walk about the stage as that animal. I want you to go home and eat a lemon. Then tomorrow return and taste the lemon again. <laughs> All right, I feel like we were in a cult. <laughs> All right, about this wonderful DVD. Have you seen this before? No. I don't think so. Are we... Uh... The way she purses her lips weirds me out. Is that wrong? Oh, yeah, sure. It's awful. <laughs> <laughs> we have it's different the tastes. Worst. It's I the see. worst. <laughs> uh, that's it for the time being. Thank you. Okay, so we need to go back, and <laughs> let's just run through it all again. Actually, we didn't go back to the dad. We didn't go back to the dad. Uh, let me. Uh, let's go back here really quick, though. Okay. To this guy and ask him about auto. I'm telling you, he's the key to something. I just don't know what. A few more questions, please. Yes. Ever heard of auto hypnosis, James? Self-hypnosis. Yeah. And what do you know about it? It's another name for scrying. What? Some people what? call it auto-hypnosis, I call it scrying. What? Right. So you're saying scrying is just self-hypnosis? Scrying? You can scry on anything. I don't use a mirror. I can scry watching the clouds. Maybe the water on a lake in the moonlight. <gasps> and when you're watching the water, what happened? Oh! You go into a trance. Oh, you lose what? yourself in your unconscious. You go deeper and deeper. You swim around. Try not to go too deep. Because if you go too deep, you start drowning. <gasps> then you get dragged down to the bottom. <gasps> as long as you stay swimming, come to the surface again. Then you wake up and see the world <laughs> as it really is. Damn your music. It's a journey to a place people talk about, but no one's ever seen. You're thinking about Kate, aren't you? What makes you say that? She bought a mirror. Sold her one last year. <gasps> was she Sorry, now we can finally catch like him on that shit. No idea. But she bought one. Right. Oh, we got you now. All right. Sold Scry Mirror to Kate, right? And what did he say about Scrying Mirror before? I think it was in the in just the Kate section, right? Yeah, maybe. That uh can't remember the last time you saw her or Kate through Simon's girlfriend uh, Emma. Can't remember the last time he saw. Her. Yeah. What? No, that's not no. gonna work. All right, all right, all right, 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 right. Damn I it! I thought that. Damn it! No, because Emma said. Emma said that he sold her a mirror the day she died. Uh, uh, yeah, all their stories are not. We need to find a way to get him though. Scrying is possible without a mirror. So scrying mirror to Kate last year. Uh, right. Yeah, what does it say on the scrying mirror stuff? So makes black scrying mirrors. Mirror just one way of scrying, which he explained other ways. Only makes mirrors for others. Sells the mirror, doesn't make a profit. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Liam's death. Uh, never heard the phrase before. Um. Didn't socialize with her? Maybe that's like. Yeah, but socializing and selling somebody a mirror Look, I'm, is I'm, different. I'm grasping straws here. I get it. Well, maybe that. Uh, can I see? Yeah. Can't remember the last time we saw her. Didn't socialize with her. New Kate. Um. No. Hmm. All right, we'll come back. Okay. I feel like we should come. Okay. Back. Yeah. Let's talk Thank to you. the dad. Probably be back later. We learned a lot there. A lot. Damn scrying mirrors, though. Yeah. Let's talk to daddy. Yes. Daddy. What does he know? Father, papa. Papa. What do you know? Go ahead. To old Brandon House. I'll ask you a couple more things, please. 
I'd love it if he was like, no. We're <laughs> like, right. can I ask you some things? No. Just go down the list. Yep. Seen this before. <laughs> the writing looks familiar, but no. It's probably because it's his damn Maybe sons. His sons, yeah. His we sons have writing. to. We, we have to wait till He's another hour passes. He's gonna be the passes. only one who yeah. knows about that thing. Yeah. All right. Doll do burning. This. What can you tell me about doll burning at Atlas? Not very much. It's one of Ryan's ideas. My son is under the illusion that he's a genius. <laughs> Damn. Is that it? <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Jesus. Okay. All right, Dan. Does um, Can't wait for Ryan this answer. play the guitar? Ryan? Ryan couldn't get a tune out of a radio. He's tone deaf. Okay, so he's never tried to go professional. If he did try, it was never going to happen. <gasps> that goes against your teachings. Gonna free to be free. He can't play guitar, so why is Emma saying that he plays guitar? And Rebecca well, and Rebecca is saying that he plays guitar. Well, but he's Maybe not... Maybe he just means my son's shit at guitar. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Me read too much into it? Crazy. No, what? What? Auto-hypnosis? Can you tell me more about the auto-hypnosis techniques used on the course? We don't use hypnosis on the course. Not at all? Not anymore. So Not how more. was it used? Hypnosis is probably the wrong word, Inspector. It's nothing to do with the trances or things like that. It was, it was meant to force... <clears throat> to help students. Did you force them? You can't force anybody into being hypnotized. You have to want to be hypnotized. It's not something out of your control. You can't be hurt or damaged in any way by hypnosis. So you've never put pressure on students to enter into hypnosis? It would be impossible to do so. Hmm. 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 Okay, let's go. There's one. Uh, that's all for the moment. We'll go Thank talk you. to Rebecca, then we'll call the chief. Okay. Because I imagine we'll get some info. Damn. We haven't we haven't asked her about auto hypnosis yet. Have no, we? no. Right. Do you know anything about hypnosis used on the Atlas course? Are you sure you mean hypnosis or the power of persuasion? What's the difference? Not a lot. But if you want someone to do something, it's usually easier to ask nicely. Atlas used persuasion techniques. Well, don't all businesses use it, Inspector? Ever heard of advertising? Hmm. What? Uh... Hmm. Uh... <laughs> Are you gonna are you gonna try and get her on some of this? Uh I don't know. Atlas would persuade people, but they encourage people to be free. Ah, that's true. That's true. That's why I'm uh uh, I don't know. Uh, right. I don't know. All right, all right, all right. Let's go talk to the chief. Be back later on if that's okay. The chief has to have something for us, right? Like, there's got to be something. Like, hey, chief. Guide hey. us. Chief. You're always there for us. Guide us this one time, please. Nothing. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Not much really, sir, except I've discovered Ryan plays the guitar. I thought you were going to tell me something useful. Well, I found out Emma was in a band, too. What, with Rand? No, I don't think so. Not sure, actually. Well, why don't you find out and ring me back when you've got something useful to tell me, yeah? Yes, Chief. Sorry, Chief. Okay, so bye -bye. we should probably focus on Emma, then? Yeah. Go back to Emma and ask about... Because we can't mm. harass... Rando. Nope. Irma! I just imagine she lets us through the window. <laughs> yeah. Like, don't let him know you're here! Okay. 
So this doesn't. This is pointless. Guitar collection. Band often played at the pub. Is this thing in a pub called? Uh. Mm. Was once offered a singing contract. Where did she talk about, uh, which section did she respond about Rebecca in the first place? Being like, yeah, I'm buddies with Rebecca. That's a good question. Is it? Uh, broken pub window. Is it the pub? Monday night to visit. Kate's argument? Uh, maybe. Knows Rebecca quite well. Are you with Kate? What about um, knows Rebecca quite well, plus uh, used to be in a band that played at. Well, that's not a contradiction. That's a confirmation. Right. Like, of course, yes. She's just sang in a pub band called Blackstone. About doll burning. I like what when she went. What was that? Oh, that was you. That was me, yeah. I thought, Sorry. I thought that was the game. I was no, like, what was, was that me. noise? Something that lit on fire? <laughs> what was that? Hmm. Has never taken uh, illegal substances. Liam's death? Hmm. Where the phrase? Liam's death. Doesn't recognize a three finger symbol. All right, first off, you can't be in a band and not recognize a three symbol finger, especially if you're in a band called Death Glock or whatever your oh, name yeah, is. Oh, yeah, that's when it came up. That's yeah. when it came up, is when Rebecca was like the three finger symbol. Well, yeah, rock bands, right? Oh, Blackstone. Yes! Yes! Come on! No! That's perfect! All right. Uh... Band often played at the pub. Doesn't recognize the. That's. Dude, come on. Come on! Uh... Come on! Uh... Okay. Um. So it's got to be something with this. It's something with this. Band often played at the pub. Was once offered a singing contract. I don't know that we can ever disprove this. Yeah. And this, Ryan once offered to buy Emma's guitar. We can never disprove that either. Because she, she never really has talked about Ryan all that much. Right. Although. Aside from boning him. Yeah. Was there anything up here about boning him? I don't think so, because we weren't allowed to tell anybody about it. Or yeah, like ask all people right. about it. We just know it as, like, side info. All right. You used to sing in a pub band called Blackstone. Boom. Done. Okay. Let's start there. Okay. Didn't see Kate very often, but she had a drinking problem. So she was at the pub all the time, right, though? So wouldn't she? I don't know. <laughs> I mean, he figured. Bike belongs to Simon Cousin. None of that matters. Bottles belong to Simon. Doesn't like beer. Uh, I still think, man, that gift was definitely from the dad. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, of course. Mm. Necklace was unwanted gift. Knows about the broken pub window. Visited the pub with a friend. Has seen, seen it the before. Mask. Had an affair with Ryan. Kate wanted to blackmail Ryan over said affair. But were you guys in a band together? <laughs> A really shitty band. New Kate had bought a mirror. Says the mirror doesn't work. Maybe that's something to do with the stuff from the... the I don't know. Oh, the like, you can't be hypnotized unless you want to be. Yeah. That stuff, yeah. Uh, can I see it? it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Um, we still have Emma used to sing in a pub. I'm trying to connect it to something. I just don't know what to connect it to. Right. Uh, what was I? I'm wondering if one of these can somehow contradict anything in here. 
There's this thing in a pub band called Blackstone. Or maybe what was once offered a singing contract. Is there anything about like her? Going no, to I didn't see anything that. Yeah, I didn't see anything about her that would contradict that so far. Um, to the pub on Monday. Yeah, that and then the the mass. Like we've gone through this. There's nothing there. There's got to be something though, right? Not once. Been to a similar course before. <gasps> what? I wonder if the similar course was the third eye stuff. Ah, uh, maybe. Anyways, doesn't recognize the three fingers. Doesn't know Liam. Question. Just go up to Liam. Er I assume he wasn't in the band, but can you click that? Oh! oh! Ah. I knew it. That band you sang in. Blackstone. Who else was in the band? Um, just a few people from college. Including Liam? Yeah. I knew it! Why did you say you didn't know him? No, it's, it's not that. I just thought you meant that I didn't know about his suicide. Did you? No, I was <clears throat> away on a holiday. When he died? Yeah, I only knew him through the band. Question for she you. She definitely huh. knows more than she's saying. She was in a band with Liam, but didn't know about his problem. I'm not sure I believe you, Emma. Emma. Did they? Did they say? Did Rebecca say that Liam was in the band? I feel like she did. Because I don't remember that at all. But the only reason why I thought that that would be that way is because you said it earlier. Yeah. And so I was like, I don't all right, I'll give it a chance. Now, but interesting. Okay. Well, we got that. So, okay. I was on holiday the night Liam died. Only knew Liam through the band Blackstone. Hmm, curiouser and curiouser. Hmm. All right, I think we need to exit. Okay, that's it for now. Thank you. UFO Commander, we are the future. We're gonna take you to the future. Then we're gonna get to the future. Where everyone talks like they're from the future. UFO Commander, we are the future. We're gonna take you to the future. Then we're gonna get to the future. Where everyone talks like they're from the future. Hello, our old four. Me, just got to number one out of the plan. The bee plays the tip top shape. I'm swell shape. And I'm gonna make a fortune for my ass for Shut the balls up. UFO Commander, we are the future. We're gonna take you to the future. Then we're gonna get to the future Where everyone talks like they're from Jump the balls up! UFO Commander, we are the future We're gonna take you to the future Then we're gonna get to the future Where everyone talks like they're from Jump the balls up! Give me that! No! 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 